All right, people. Um, how you doing, my my YouTube family? It is uh, Tuesday, and it is October twenty second, twenty thirteen. Let's get on with it because I love these lips. These lips, I am loving. This is the embellished lip gloss by Revlon Colorburst. Can I tell you, I have enjoyed putting this on all day. It needed to be retouched, true, but I don't know what formula they're using, or maybe it's the brush. I don't know, it's just the regular, it's one of those flat tip brushes, and it just goes on so soft. And it has a chemically chemical smell, but it's like a chemical mixed with caramel, if that makes any kind of sense. But I'm loving these lips. Loving these lips. This is Revlon Color Burst in Embellished, people. This is one smooth, smooth. It's not creamy. It's just downright smooth. This is embellished. Love it. This is a color I'm going to use quite often. And it is a lip gloss, as you can see. I lined my lips with my sad and pathetic and pitiful looking MAC pencil in Current. This thing looks like it's been through the war. Sad and pitiful but it did the job. So, lined with current, filled with Revlon embellished, and Nancy was a happy camper all damn day, can I just tell you? All damn day. So, I finally kind of, I'm practicing with this here hourglass with the ambient lighting and the and I'm using the incandescent light. I kind of want to get rid of the incandescent light. It's not like I want to get rid of it, but, you know, I just want to use this one up because it's the lightest one. So I think yesterday, if you look at yesterday's video, I was looking kind of ghostly. Or maybe it was just me, and I just didn't like the way my makeup came out yesterday. Today, I like it a lot because I've been looking at videos and all of this and, you know, trying to test it out. You have to, it's a, t it's a trial and error situation with any new makeup product. Everybody should know this. If you're not really familiar with how to use it, if it's not as simple as a lip gloss or a lipstick or, you know, something that's new and out there and you just don't know how to use it and how it's going to look on you, trial and error, trial and error. So I am practicing with the middle one, with incandescent, the lightest one in the middle right here. This was, it, it came in the special edition. This is the special edition because it does, incandescent light is not, you can't get it in a single pack. This, it's a special, it's the limited edition that comes in this particular trio. So, I don't know if you can tell, but I kind of used it, maybe that's the way it's supposed to be used, as a highlighter. So I kind of did a little bit over here. And a little bit over here, I did across my forehead, a little bit down my nose and on the chin. And I did a little up here and a little over here and on the sides of my face. So I'm not using it. Before I mixed it up with my um, MAC powder, it doesn't work too well like that. It makes me look like a ghost or it makes me feel like I look like a ghost. It's supposed to be used with a light hand to give you that glow of some sort. So I'm using it in certain parts where light is supposed to hit your face. So it's usually a T-zone here, here, and you know, winged on the cheekbones. So I don't know if you can tell. I can tell the difference because I feel more, I, I feel comfortable with the makeup today as opposed to yesterday. And I can sort of see a difference. I don't know, you let me know. Maybe I'm seeing things or maybe I wanna see something that's not really there. You can tell me. But I'm not disappointed at this at all. I am not disappointed with this at all. Oh, I am enjoying using this. But I want to kind of familiarize myself with this particular shade first 
with the incandescent shade first and then I'll focus on the other two so right now I just want to kind of eliminate the light one first so this is gonna last a year and a day people I don't know so that is that with that upon that there is really um no news news I need to take a wipe to wipe my in my embellished my incandescent my embellished excuse me I'm all up in your face um I don't have any news news but I need to shout somebody out and I told her I was going to do so um S Lou yes S Lou she wants me to count my glosses but she was too embarrassed to ask me to count my glosses because she knows she knows damn well that I'm not going to count my glosses glosses it's still up in the air as to whether I'm counting my lipsticks because Positively Nice wants me to count my lipsticks. So I may do that on my vacation and maybe I'll make a video over that. I do, however, need to make a video when my NYX lipsticks comes. So um, I don't know if they'll be coming tomorrow or, when, or Thursday. I don't know. They may come when my vacation starts. So I may do a video when they arrive. Um, so you'll have that to, um, to deal with because I'll be in my whole red mode. And, uh, S. Lou, you know you ain't going to get your wish, right? You, now, you know damn well you're not going to get me to count the lip glosses because that's the drawer that can't close, honey. That's the drawer that can't close. Okay? So, no. And as you can see, I just added another lip gloss. So, I just have to kind of shove it in there to just kind of make it fit in there. But um, positively nice, you may. I'm not promising you anything, but you may get your wish, and I may count my lipsticks. Now, Deb, who's ever so helpful. I, you know I love you, Deb. Deb is um, Mrs. The Doll. Deb suggested, well, if you're going to count your lipsticks, uh, why don't you do them in the uh, order of brand? Like, take out all the Revlons, take out all the Maybellines, take out all the Macs. I was just going to take one, two, three. I was just going to do it like that. Now you want me to get all uniform about it. You want me to take out all my Macs and all my Revlons and all my Maybellines. Look, people, you want me to count my lipsticks. I'm going to count the damn lipsticks. If I feel like counting the lipsticks, I will count the lipsticks. But there's not going to be any uniform. I'm not going to set, tell you how many Macs I have. I'm not good. I did my collections, people. I did my Mac collection, if I'm not mistaken. I did my Revlon collection, if I'm not mistaken. I did some sort of collections. I did some collections, some Maybellines. Those are the only ones you're going to get. I'm not going to do any more. But um, I am going to count my lipsticks. You want me to count the lipsticks? I'll count the damn lipsticks. But I am not going to take them out or max or rep. No, 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 no. Deb, you know I love you. We are like this. Deb and I are like this. We are like that. You know we are. Deb, you know. But, um, no, no. Nancy is not going to do max. She's not going to do Revlon. She's, mm, I'm just going to do one two, three, I'm just going to take them out and just count and just be done with it. And the number is going to add up once the NYX comes. So I'll just wait until they come and then I'll just make a collective counting of every single one. Okay. You people are making my blood pressure rise. I know it's out of love. I do. I feel the love. I feel the love. But y'all are pressuring me with some love. Y'all are pressuring. But I love you all. I love each and every one of you. And it's almost every single day that I get a newbie as a subscriber. My family. I don't think my real family, and Lord only knows my real family, my extended family, cousins, aunts, uncles, uh, distant cousins, that line will go on forever, okay? Um, so I have a huge, real-life family. 
but my YT family, my YouTube family, oh my goodness, growing and growing and growing and almost every single day, new person has subscribed to your channel. I just, you know, I love it. I really, really enjoy it. And what makes me happy is when I get comments of, girl, you so funny. Girl, you made me laugh. Girl, you are hilarious. I like that. I, and I don't mean to try to be funny. I'm just me. I'm just talking. This is me. This is who I am every single day, 365 days a year. This is who I am. Love me, hate me, whatever. I'm just glad I have a sense of humor that everybody tends to get. And you're enjoying my life stories, or at least my work stories. You're in my life, no matter what. I'm not, I'm sharing with you, you know, personal stuff or, you know, cat stuff or work stuff. I share with you. And I'm enjoying the fact that you're enjoying my stories. I didn't think I was that much of a funny person, but I am sort of the clown in my family, like during Thanksgiving or whatever, when we're playing games and whatnot, I do tend to, the mouth tends to go and I do crack my family up and I love it so much because I feel the love and I feel the warmth when like we're all gathered together and we're like eating and suddenly it's like really quiet and everybody's eating and then I'll just come out with something. And people, like, soda comes out of their nose because they're laughing so much. They didn't expect anybody to say anything. You know, I, I tend to do that every now and then, and I love it. I've always been that way. Not to say that I've been the class clown, but I have always had a quirky sense of humor or just a sense of humor in general. And I enjoy making people laugh. Why didn't I become a comedian? Because I don't think I'm that kind of a funny I can't do stand-up. It's not like I can do stand-up. I don't have those kind of jokes, but I am a funny person, and, you know, I like to make people laugh. So anytime I get those kind of comments, it just, it's like a hug. It's like a hug to me, that you're hugging me with your laugh, because it's, it's, it just makes me feel very good. And I really am glad that you're laughing, because whether it's laughing at me or with me, I really don't care. Laughter to me, I have said it once, I've said it all before cures all ills. It makes you feel good. You can't feel bad when you're laughing. Ha, it, they don't go together. So if anything, I like to make people feel good. And if it's making you laugh, all the better. And on that note, that is it, people. That is it. You know what tomorrow is, honey. Mm, I don't know what I'm going to do with this hair. I may put it in. You know the, the, those big buns that are in now? You know that the, you, you, the, this gets all tight and you get this big, like, Princess Leia half a bun. Because, you know, she had two of them on her ears. But, you know, they have them big now like this. I think Kim Kardashian started that whole thing with the... with the. So, I've got the, the tool to make the bun. So, I may try to put my hair up like that. But I just don't want to give myself a headache. And putting up... Because I have, I have a tender head. So... I, I don't, if I'm going to put my hair up, it's got to be in a certain, it's got to be direct. The ponytail has to be in a certain area where I don't, it doesn't instantly give me a headache. Or I could do a lower bun. I don't know. Or should I keep my hair out? I don't know, people. I do know what I'm going to wear, though. You'll see me in red. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. That was a car honking. I don't know. So tomorrow is Ben Affleck Day, in case y'all don't know. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, seek previous videos. And on that note, that is it. That is all I've got for you. Mm. My hair's been bothering me all damn day. Okay, let's... Oh, look who it is. He knew I was ending the video. He just had to make a, a, an appearance. Look at him, just making himself all damn comfortable. Look. And giving me the mean eye. Look at that. Hi, baby. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Um. I guess he's trying to tell me, look, mom, you, you know, I was kind of sleeping underneath the bed, but you just talking so damn loud. I just might as well make myself known to let you know that I was trying to sleep. Did you see that look he gave me? And now he's just not even, he's not even bothering. Now he's just comfortable on top of the bed. Mm, 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 mm. 
Life of a cat, honey. But you know I love him so damn much. He is living like a king up in this house, okay? He is living like a king in this house. I'm sure his past is, I hope, a distant memory. I'm sure it's not, but um, this is a major improvement as to where he's come from, okay? So, and he ain't going nowhere either. Not over my dead corpse. Not going anywhere. Okay. So, I, ooh, ew. I don't know why I just decided to, oh, dead corpse and all. Okay, it's the Halloween season. On that note. Okay. So, this is Lips of the Day. Fill me in. Let me know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down in the middle. This is a definite thumbs up for me because I am loving. Loving. Mmm. -hmm. Loving this shade. So that's it, people. I love you. I love my YouTube family. You know I do. I just spoke to you about the love, even though there are certain people that are driving me crazy. You know who you are. Um, But you know it's all out of love. You're driving me crazy out of love, and I am taking it out of love. Out of love. So um, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of bitching and moaning, but I'm... I'm I'm loving the bitching and moaning because you know, if you, if I was really pissed at you, you would know I would be really pissed at you. You know this, but I'm not because you're my YouTube family. I love you all. Let me know what you think. Hit me up and I will talk to you tomorrow to fill you in on Ben Affleck day. Okay. I love you. And, uh, still nothing. Okay. I love you. I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye now.